young professional, I've had to decide what I want my life to be about. Um, and one of the fundamental values, my core values that I've decided is that I would like my impact of my time to be net positive. I leave my house in the morning, get on a bicycle, and ride about a quarter mile to um, Lake Combi. From there, I have a paddleboard that I throw in the water and walk onto um, and paddle across Combi to the other side where I stash a scooter. I got a 110cc Honda scooter at a family friend's house. That I then rip up the road over here, which is about three miles to Sierra Academy. The thing I like about my commute is the fact that it logically helps me uh, save time and money. It spiritually helps me reflect and it aligns much more closely with my values as far as the impact that I'm having while I'm doing it. Um, but beyond that, it's also just fun. Um, it really is fun to be out, dressed for work, um, with the backpack on, paddling across the lake with all the goofy looks that I get from early morning fishermen and water skiers. Um, so there's also the fun fact. There's no sacrifice in getting to work in this way, and it's just better. But it's not how, it's not the standard way to get to work. Most folks think about getting to work and they look up, they would get in the car and drive on the main roads to get to where they work. Just because something was done a certain way doesn't mean that it should continue to be done a certain way. It really comes down to breaking a problem down to its real constraints and kind of eliminating some of the here's how we did it so we should continue to do it that way. And then at the same time, it doesn't mean to throw out the, the best parts of, of something, that, uh, of, of knowledge um, and of tradition. Uh, but tradition for tradition's sake is hard for me. There's always some risk of when you, when you try and do something in a different way. And I would say that most of the time that the risk is manageable, you can manage the risk. I could get a dry bag for my computer. And the worst case scenario is I come to school wet. Um, with teaching and learning, based on student exploration of ideas, there's some risk. There's some risk that a student might not know what the next step is. Um, but there's some safety in that of what we can just assess accurately and use the data about what a kid knows to push them to learn the next thing. This is probably the most ambitious time of my life where I'm working to take, I'm working to st stop taking that questioning of but what about the way that we've always done it? And, and, and say that people, I think, in a lot of ways, they ask that without, without intent, but it can shut a lot of people down. If like, it, it's like, you're questioning me, I probably shouldn't do it. There's probably something wrong with this. Right now, my confidence is really high that I should sometimes ignore that question. And get to work the best way that I know how, do my work the best way that I know how, create an environment for education in the best way that I know how.